good morning guys welcome back to my channel um it's faith martini here and today i'm going to be um taking you along as me and the boys go for their six month checkup so today is actually the 18th of um gosh the 18th of september they turned six months on the 6th but i didn't set up their six month appointment i forgot to do it so i was able to get a quick one in and so we're just gonna get ready and head on out um, to go see how they are progressing um now if you like videos like this videos about motherhood lifestyle and um cleaning videos and baby videos then don't forget to hit that subscribe button guys i post videos every week um the goal is to post videos two to three times a week but i've kind of been um, not meeting that goal that i said but that's uh, what i'm aiming at but i do post videos every week on here so definitely um subscribe and stay tuned for more videos so yeah we're just gonna go ahead i uh, at this point i am getting them all dressed up for the day uh they actually woke up you know a while ago so they woke up around eight and um i was able to feed them at that point and then um put them down so that i can go and take a shower um and then try to get ready <laughs> so i was able to take a shower but by the time that i finished they were you know fussy wanted to be held and whatnot so I decided it would be just best for me to change them right now um, and then I can make my breakfast and um, continue getting ready so yeah I'm just changing them here gosh my boy has been giving me such a hard time when I dress him he likes to roll around like this and it's so frustrating and he's so strong like I just I can't seem to get him to stay in one place um <laughs> that's like one of the things that i'm dealing with right now with the developments but i i do love that he can turn around like that i love that he's strong you know i'm i'm, I'm counting my blessings and i'm grateful for all that but it can be really really frustrating <laughs> and tiring too like just trying to get shorts on him is <laughs> is such a struggle sometimes but yeah, so I'm really excited to see how they're going to be doing today. I mean, how their development is when we get to the to the doctor. But yeah, so I hope you enjoy watching this video, guys. And don't forget to leave a like if you actually liked it. Now, they were being really, really fussy. So after I had fed them, I mean, dressed them and let them sit for a while, I decided to feed them again. And I didn't really show the feeding part here. But this is just right after that. I gave them um, and then I just bopped them um, so that <laughs> they can be all cool while I was um, trying to get my stuff done. So now we're in the kitchen and I'm just going to set them down and let them play around in this little walker so that I can actually make my own breakfast and eat something. Um, usually I try to get them distracted so that they, uh, they can focus on something else while I try to um, get something done.
get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie That I die I can't hide just made it to the um, doctor's office and we're about to get the boys all checked out and stuff so oh my gosh <laughs> I'm doing this alone today so it is oh it's tiring but um, the boys are now ready to oh my gosh I have to take their clothes off and undress them to their diapers uh, <laughs> right baby shoes are already off um, because they didn't want to keep their shoes on this one too right baby i really need to wash this this some cribs but yeah i'm about to get them undressed so that we can get this fun going babies you're gonna get shots today <laughs> i know we're both gonna be crying on this one okay so i had to one of the nurses actually came and helped me which was really really sweet now i have hodari here we're gonna go get weighed. Milo is already being weighed right now, so. Uh, oh my gosh. How much do you weigh? 15 and 3, the other one is 14. Hmm. Are you waving at me? Yeah. Pick up 
Okay guys, so we just finished the weigh-in and measurements. So now we're just waiting on the doctor to come and uh, we can see what's up. We just finished with the um, checkup. Oh my gosh. And also the weights and the measurements. The boys are not where they need to be at the moment. Um, their weight is actually at, well, Hodari is at 15 pounds. This is Hodari. He's at 15 pounds right now. While Milo is like 14 pounds and some ounces. Um, so they haven't gained as much weight um, within the last two months since their four month checkup. But um, I definitely will be trying a few more things to make sure that they can continue to eat more. Right now they got so fussy so I just had to give them some breast milk from um, the milk that I provided from them to, well that I prepared for them this morning. <laughs> My little guys are already holding their own bottles because they want to be a Mr. Independence. But now we're just waiting on the nurse because they're going to get their, their shorts today which I, I just don't like but we gotta do it so we're just waiting on that and um we'll see how it goes but other than the weight their height is good their um the other measurements are, are good it's just the weight i guess that they're not getting as fast as possible and now it's i mean of course they're twins and i'm breastfeeding both of them so um it's definitely a lot but i might have to supplement with formula um we'll just have to see what the best option is but um, other than that, everything else is good. Um, they do have some eczema, but I'm going to get some cortisol um, to kind of help with that. And um, yeah, but <laughs> they're getting awful already. Oh my gosh, baby, isn't that enough? Isn't that enough? Look, when I try to take the bottle out. My guy is like really full, but he'll scream for the bottle. Oh, there you go. There you go. And he's like multitasking. <laughs> You cannot, you cannot. Baby, can you do it like this so you can get all of it? No. But yeah. So we're just gonna wait on the nurse and then the fun will begin. <laughs> the boys are still eating, still waiting on the nurse. My guys here are just going. They will, I mean, I literally fed them before we left and they still drank nine ounces of milk. I, I don't, I don't get it. Maybe this is the reason they're not drinking as much or they drink and then they feel like they've gotten enough and then they stop. Um, but I might be pumping more often too so that I can be able to give them the bottled milk after they've breastfed. But yeah, so that's that. The nurse actually brought over some um, formula that I'm gonna be taking, so I don't know. I'm still kind of anxious on trying this, but we'll see how it how it goes. Oh, 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 oh. come on, do you, do you, do you, do you, shika, shika. Hey, Toto, I keep ukuko sa maziwa zo. Hey, this kid zo. <laughs> Don't they? If you take away the milk now, they they get mad. This one has done now, but then I don't actually get to bottle. So what are you getting from this, baby? It's over. Yo, it's out. There's no more. But he just wants to hold on to it and suck on it, which is, of course, gas. And we're going to have to do some serious bopping later on because you're going to be crying over the gas that you have sucked up. Look at his belly. But still, he just wants to continue eating. Now, the other thing that, you know, I've been struggling with is the um, eczema. Oh, my gosh, man. I really hate. And, we you know, their skin is really dry because of the, the weather that we're in right now but um I, I lotion them every day but still it doesn't improve as much as i want and then also you can see the eczema all over their feet or uh, legs and it's it really sucks i hate it so much but we're gonna try cortisol for that as well to see how that um you know progresses this guy is still drinking his milk he does not want to stop this one does not want to stop even though the milk is out just wants to keep holding on to the bottle Right, but I guess we're happy now, right? You're not crying anymore. That's good. <laughs> but yeah, still waiting for the doctor. Or nurse, rather. Let's you. Yum. Take it. Good. 
You were still hungry, huh? Oh my gosh. Good. I've eaten way too much. Mm -hmm. the eczema or something yeah they do mm -hmm. have eczema so hopefully the cortisol will help oh my goodness baby holding down my <laughs> wow twins run in your family no this is actually the first ones in my family oh really yeah. probably huh, skip the generation oh my gosh <laughs> yeah oh no baby no 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 Oh, I don't like this part either, baby. I'm so sorry. Uh, oh, no. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Okay. It's, this is the flu. Yeah, that one might be. Oh, yeah. baby. This one, the last one. Yeah. Is the one that really burns. Okay? Oh, no. That's the forever one. Oh, baby. Sorry. It's done. Oh, okay. You can do that. Uh, okay. This one now. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. You have yeah. This one is more. Yeah, he's, he's not going to. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 There you go. That one's done. <laughs> well, they look, they look identical. <laughs> oh, did, they, did they tell you they were No, they're identical? fraternal. I know they might look identical, yeah. but they have some similarities. Mm -hmm. Not so many differences, rather. Right. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's your brother's turn, baby. You're done. Yeah. Now it's your brother's turn. Your brother's left the bottle, so we'll see how long yeah. he'll keep it in there. Oh, baby. Oh, no, 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 no. Same no. thing. No, no, this no. This one is the blue. It's okay, actually. baby. It's Oops. okay, love. It's, it's okay. Good. It's okay. Let's see. This is the one, the oh, same thing, job, my friend. This is the one. Oh. <laughs> oh, baby. Actually, Mom, they both did awesome. <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah. Did not last as long this time, and I guess it's because they fed. But oh, now I'm just going to get them all dressed up, and then we can head out. Right, babies? Oh. <laughs>
to tell la la okay i literally have to sing for them to stop crying um i was gonna go get some Tylenol, but i haven't been able to do that we just got home um about uh, a few minutes ago actually um we got home around 1 p.m from the doctor's appointment and i was just like oh i'm just gonna come i'm just gonna put them down um and they're gonna go to sleep because they actually started sleeping when we were in a oh, while wow, we were in the car but they don't want to go to sleep now so um i just had to close this video guys that's why i'm here with them because they won't be let down i do have to i didn't want to um i mean i i can you know let them just continue crying so basically um as you already saw we went to the doctor today um it was their six month checkup you we were able to go there um and uh they got their measurements and their weights now the doctor said that of they're not really gaining as much weight and actually what was funny is when uh he actually saw the results at first he thought that they were um that they were wrong so he actually wanted it done again so they um weighed them a, a second time but it came up the same with the same um as before which was 15 pounds for hodari right here and 14 and some ounces for milo milambo so um so of course then we kind of talked about um you know their feeding schedule how much they actually eat and what they eat um and right now i'm breastfeeding and also i've introduced solids to them so that's what we've been doing so far um and honestly they eat like you know with baby like they don't they don't really complain that they're not getting enough right i mean if they were i would have noticed i would have um done something different so they've been like they've seemed really content and that's what the doctor actually said too like you know they might seem content now uh, when they feed they feed up to you know whatever level they feel like they have eaten enough and then they stop i never really put a limit for them when it comes to feeding and i feed them multiple times a day so um in addition to feeding i also give them the bottle once i have uh, some milk pumped and they usually drink like nine ounces like i think you saw that already in the video they can drink nine ounces um in one sitting like it's ridiculous but but um they gave us the formula i am really uh hesitant on taking formula on them taking formula because i've kind of tried to control what they eat um as if you haven't seen my other videos i actually make my own baby food at home so that i don't have to um buy uh you know store-bought uh, baby food and so i really try to control what they eat um and with formula i just i just don't know like whenever when i started breastfeeding i never really the goal in my mind was i'm gonna breastfeed you know i never really had the intention of using anything else or supplementing but of course things changed and um i don't know that i'm gonna actually do the formula i think i'm just gonna try feeding them more um they've definitely been really responsive to feeding and to um the solids that we've been giving them so i'm probably gonna use those more i'm also gonna incorporate some other um solids uh too because they definitely love to eat so i'll try that um and then uh i guess you know i will decide how we can go forward uh with that but we do have another appointment within a month to actually go and um to go and get them weighed again they got their flu shots today but they're also going to get another flu shot um in a month so we're gonna go back for another appointment in october so hopefully they'll have gained some weight by then um the goal is to have them at 18 pounds um by that eight, by that um, time but it might not really happen they can't really gain three pounds in a month but we'll see we'll see um so that's pretty much what happened today guys i uh, really appreciate you tuning in to this video um if you are a mom of multiples i would love to you know hear your experience about breastfeeding i know breastfeeding is definitely hard it's challenging um it takes a lot you know um, i'm actually going to be making a video about my breastfeeding experience and tips that i have um you know as a mom you know feeding two boys for six months uh but uh, i'm gonna be making that video here pretty soon 
but if you are a mom of twin boys and you've been feeding your boys breast milk how long did you go you know how did you breastfeed um, till they were a year or did you stop at some point and supplement with um, with the formula I would love to hear that guys um, I know that some people might say oh you know you should just you stop breastfeeding and you know, use formula and honestly i appreciate uh, that's your opinion and i thank you for you for having an opinion but i'm gonna do what i feel like is best for me and my kids but that's pretty much it for this video guys thank you so much for tuning in really appreciate you watching hope you enjoyed the video and i'll be seeing you on the next one have a great day bye say bye say bye <laughs> they can't really wave yet they can just uh, yeah do you want to say bye to the camera Say bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, bye bye.